Welcome back to the channel, boys. Fabulous, he's coming at you next with the best early game weapon in Ghost of Tsushima. So I started a hard playthrough recently, and I've just been experimenting with some of the different uh, abilities and stuff you can use. I'm um, not a big fan of the bow. Uh, I'm not a big fan of like the explosives or anything. I feel like <laughs> I like to play not like stealthy, but uh, just like an actual samurai. I feel like samurais don't. I mean, I don't know, of course. But I feel like using explosives and stuff isn't really like. Uh, the samurai way like I like to use the sword I like to use kunai and stuff but there's one particular weapon that I think is the best out of all of them let me show you guys right here so when I go to the gear I go here this right here the smoke bomb this by far is the best weapon to have in the early game it can turn the tides in so many fights it's crazy and let me just show you why right here so once you get the smoke bomb and if you pair it with the chain assassination. I have mine all the way to three, right? And then this combined with uh, this right here, the standoff streak. If you go up into like a group of enemies, you do the standoff streak, you kill like three enemies, then you run into them, throw a smoke bomb, you can kill another three enemies instantly. And, you know, it can really turn the tides if you're having a, a big problem with fighting big groups of enemies. If you just do this combination, you guys will see that it can really. Uh, change the way that these fights outcome and like it'll give you a big advantage now up here I, I marked a little uh, Mongol territory so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you guys what this can do as I make our way here look at this man this game is just so beautiful so beautiful like wow I have some crazy screenshots and just unbelievable it makes me want to go to Japan obviously I know that Japan isn't a uh, like this anymore i mean maybe the countryside is i don't know but damn like look at this the atmosphere is just like phenomenal all right let's go so here we go here we are i guess i'll do a standoff as soon as i can get close enough let's go ahead and hide in the grass all right let's go standoff. okay let's see it what you gonna do Done. All right, next one. Oh, he got me. I'm buns. That's a leader. Okay, okay, okay. Ready? Chain assassinate. Next. Who's next? Boom. You're next. Come here. All of you. Go right back to the kunai. Ready? And then I'm gonna do another smoke bomb. Oh, it didn't do the chain assassinate. That's alright, I still got him. Still got him. Oh, more kunai. Messing me up, okay. Get out of here. Done. And he's next. Let's go. Let's go. And I learned the moon stance. <laughs> As you guys can see, having that smoke bomb and playing around it, uh, so powerful. So powerful. Alright, let's see here. Got a trophy too, okay. Highly effective against brutes. Alright, bet. Okay, solid, cool. Check that out in a little bit. I think. Oh, you don't want me to go to main stance? That's it. There's some more guys. Alright, let's go ahead and clear this out. Eat that kunai. Get it? Okay. Where are they? I'm a big fan of the water stance in this game. I think the water stance is just like so cool. I'll show you guys why. Let's go ahead and climb up here. Where are they at? Where are they at? I see him. Should we pull out the long bow? No, let's pull out the half bow. Am I nice? Stop that. Couldn't headshot him. Dead. There we go. Headshot it and give me that technique point. <laughs> But yeah, man, as you guys can see, that smoke bomb is just fire. Um, I'm going to loot this place and talk a little bit. So I really want to do a lethal run through with no uh, this mode, the hearing mode. I don't like to use it anyway, but I'm going to do a lethal run with no hearing mode. If you guys definitely, uh, if you guys want to see that, definitely stay tuned to the channel. There's going to be a long series. And also once the multiplayer drops, I'm going to be on that hard. I think that the multiplayer has a lot of potential. That four player co-op, there's different classes. 
Um, they haven't really said much about the actual gameplay of it. Like, is there going to be loot? Is there going to be different weapons that give different stats or whatever? Um, but there's definitely different cl classes, so that means that there's going to be skill trees at least. So I'm really excited for that, and there's going to be raids. Uh, I just can't wait. Horde mode, two-player missions and stuff. It's just going to be so sick. So I'm a huge fan of this game. This might be one of the best PlayStation games I've ever played. It's like right up there with God of War and Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, I'm really liking it. So if you guys like this, definitely subscribe, like, and be on the lookout for more content. But if you guys like this content, please like, subscribe, and share. It truly helps me out a lot. You can also check out my other videos. I have some Bleeding Edge content, some Destiny content. There's going to be more Ghost of Tsushima content, so definitely be on the lookout for that. And you might as well check out my social media. I have a Twitter and an Instagram, both at fan underscore I've posted some of my screenshots from there, so go ahead and check that out. But with all that being said, deuces.